For family-owned and operated La Quinta Inn and Suites on Earl Rudder Freeway in College Station, the phones haven't stopped ringing. Thank you for calling College Station La Quinta North. This is Amon. Unfortunately, we do not have any rooms available. Bouncing off of a sold out weekend from the youth football tournament and now the increased demand for a hotel room from severe power outages, this locally owned hotel says it's been a journey. What's happening is everybody in our city is not experiencing power and we are, but we are just wait. We're fortunate enough to have our power on for the past day, but we don't know if it's going to go out or not. Amon says the hardest part is not knowing if they will fall victim to the mandatory blackouts being felt statewide. And for precautions, we've already asked guests to actually not use the elevators in case they do shut us out in any moment. Outside of solo manning long shifts, employees not being able to make it into town due to hazardous road conditions, Amon says he's seen some positives on the other side. I hope that we're able to attain these guests and in the future they know that if something happens, they can at least trust us over here at Call Station. Across town, Greg Stafford with Texas A&M's Hotel and Conference Center says they're using the spaces they have to best serve the community and those answering the call of the current Texas freeze outages. We've also had a, a number of folks uh, both within the city and within the community who are responding to this uh, condition, uh, utility folks, uh, 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 food workers, uh, uh, others that are that are uh, serving the people. They say everything is bigger in Texas, and up until recently, that has almost never included the dumping of snow and below freezing temperatures. But you could say the hotel industry is weathering the storm right beside us. Reporting in College Station, Hannah King, 25 News.